Well, the second comedy film this afternoon also includes Leslie Phillips, this time as one of the beneficiaries of the greatest practical joker of his time, Henry Russell, who left the best joke till the end. Some will, some won't. Saturday Cinema Part 2 follows in 25 minutes on BBC Two, after the turn of those younger viewers awaiting Play Away. Now, to get us started this week, we're going to have a Play Away challenge. Now, who's wearing coats here? You've got a coat, you've got a coat, you've got a coat. You... Right, now, I want you to stand up. To stand up, right? Now, do you think that you can button up your coats in 10 seconds? No. Starting, well, try it. Button up your coats in 10 seconds, starting from now. I haven't got any buttons. <laughs> you haven't got any buttons. buttons there, look. Look, there you are. Just that one. That's it. Now, button up in 10 seconds. Five, eight, nine, ten. Stop. Who's done it? Nobody. Nobody's done it. And do you know why? Because I challenge you to button up your coats in 10 seconds. And what did you do? You buttoned them down. Oh, yes. Give me a P. 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 Give me an L. 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 Give me an A. 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 Give me a Y. 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 Give me an A. 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 W. Makes your fingers tingle. <laughs> well, howdy, stranger. Howdy. You're new around these parts, aren't you, stranger? That's right. I don't know a soul hereabouts. Well, let, let me introduce you to some of the boys. This here's Red Reagan. This here's Brownie Windsor. And that there's Black Jack. Well, folks call me Blue Peter. <laughs> Howdy, boys. Howdy, Howdy Blue, Blue Peter. Peter. Say, I don't recollect getting your name, partner. Well, folks around these parts call me Hopalong. So, you're Hopalong, eh? Uh-huh. Well, I waited a long time to meet you, Hopalong. Uh-huh. And now I plan to teach you a lesson. Well, nobody teaches Hopalong a lesson. Well, I sure plan to. Uh-huh. 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 And just what lesson are you planning to teach me, Blue Peter? I'm planning to teach you how to make this really useful holster out of an old <laughs> washing <laughs> bottle, uh, some sticky back plastic, and an old belt. Now, this is one I made up earlier. Well, that's, that's really fantastic. Mm, yeah. <laughs> My brother used to be a cowboy, you know. Really? Yeah. There's a picture of him. What's his name? He's my great big brother, still best. He's got to roll 40 medals on his chest. Big chest. He fought a thousand Indians in the West. He knows no rest. Bigger the man, stronger the punch. Don't push, just shove. Plenty of room for you and me. He's got an arm. What's it like? Like a leg. Like a leg. And the punch that would sink a battleship. Big ship. It takes all the army and the navy to put the wind up. So best. Oh, that looks like you. Who is it? Well, here's a little story 
To tell it is a must About an unsung hero Who gathers up the dust Some people make a fortune Others make a mint My old man don't earn much In fact, he's flipping skint Oh! My old man's a dustman He wears a dustman's hat He wears cold, blimey trousers And he lives in a council flat I say, I say, I say! What do you say? I found a police dog in my dustbin. How uh, do you know he's a police dog? He had a policeman with him. Oh, blimey! So if you see a dustman looking all pale and sad, don't kick him in the dustbin, cos he might be my old dad. Sounds nice, your dad. Yeah. Ah. Who are they? Well, we don't like to talk about them. Sisters, sisters, there were never such devoted sisters. Never had to have a chaperone, no sir. I'm here to keep my eye on her. Caring, sharing, every little thing that we are wearing. When a certain gentleman arrived from Rome, she wore the dress and I stayed home. Lord help the mister who comes between me and my sister. And Lord help the sister who comes between me. Who comes between me? Who comes between me and my man? We're such nice people with nice manners, but we've got no money. Such nice habits, oh, we keep rabbits, but we've got no money at all. Our father keeps our mother, our mother keeps our brother. And when we're running short of cash, we borrow from each other, cos we're nice people with nice manners, but we've got no money at all. Total, I'm the model of an old job man. Yes. Yeah. That over there. No, 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 no. That won't do. <laughs> like that. Yeah. Up there. And then um, there. Good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Molly, sir. Ah, Can I help you, sir? Yes. Can you tell me, is this the tramp's outfit to shop? It is the only tramp's outfit to shop in the country, sir. Yes, I'm very exclusive. It is, sir. Ah, splendid. Well, you see, I'd like to become a tramp. Ah. Because I'm tired of working in a stuffy old office all day, you oh, see. Oh, yes, sir. You want to get out onto the open road. Yes, Into yes. the countryside. Mm -hmm. Yes, the freedom of it, sir. Getting to know all the animals. Yes. <coughs> what was that, sir? Indigestion? No, 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 no. That was a pheasant. Oh, a pheasant. Yes, you couldn't get to know them, sir. <laughs> well, you've come to the right place, you Am know. I? Yes, yes. Everything here for the tramp, sir. From spats to hats and laces to braces. Sir. Marvellous, marvellous. But what do I need to become a tramp? I mean, I mean, what do you suggest? Oh, uh, well, um, why, why not start at the top, sir, and have a hat? Yes, give me your hat. Yes, sir. righto. Yes, thank you, sir. There we yeah. are, there we are. Because hats are in this year, oh, sir. I see, yes, I yes. On. Yes, have a look yes. in the mirror, sir. Oh, well, I'm not How's sure that? about this one. I'm not really sure about this at all. I mean, I don't think it's quite, quite me, you know. No, I see what you mean, sir. Yes. Could I have it back? Back a moment, sir. Yes, yes. He just needs a slight, slight alteration, sir. There, how's that? Oh, yes, yes, better. Oh, isn't that's it? marvellous. Yes, yeah. I like that. Yes. Do you know, sir, that makes you look really very, very, very trampish. Do you think oh, so? Yes, sir. Do you yes. really? Oh, well, I'll marvellous. take it then. I'll Good. take it. Yes. <laughs> now, what about a jacket? Eh? Jacket, sir? Jacket? Yes, I think I've got the very thing, sir. Just really? slip that off yes. and hang it on the hook, sir. Hang it on the hook. Yes. Um, I'm sorry, I can't seem to see any hooks at all. Hooks? Now, we are a bit short of hooks, sir. Hang on a moment, sir. Yes. There you are. Hang it on that one, sir. Ah, oh, right. Yeah. Lovely. All right, good. <laughs> now, ah, oh, here we are. Oh, no. Oh, something wrong? Yeah, well, so, see, it's been hanging on the hanger for so long, so all the creases have dropped out of it. Oh, so, I'll soon put that to rights, though. It should have been done before. I yes. do apologise, sir. Yep. 
Yeah, there we are, sir. Marvellous. Right. Now, hold out your arms. Yes. Because yes. this is the very latest thing, sir, from the world's leading designer of clothes for tramps, sir. Really? Yes, Alphonse. Alphonse, not, uh, not Alphonse of Savile Row. No, Alphonse of the Balls Pond Road, sir. Ah, yes. <laughs> I know. Now, just a moment, sir. Yes. I think it needs trimming a little, sir. We need a few more patches, patches? on this. Patches? Yes. How would you like a little mauve one? Yes. Uh, on there, sir. Oh, mauve lovely. Mauve one there. Little red one on the lapel there, oh, sir. Oh, yes, that's yes. marvellous. And yes, I think yes, a nice yes, yellow yes. one. So a nice one. yellow one straight mm. on the hat. Sir. On the hand. Oh! Oh, oh <laughs> sorry, sir. Hold on. Hang on. I don't want to pull your eyebrows off. Right. Oh, there you that's are. Better. Sorry about that. Lovely. That's ah, it. it feels a little tight, actually, around the That's back it. Here. That's yes. it. Well, just turn around, little... sir. Let me have a look. Mm. Oh, yes, I see what you mean. So, well, yes. I'll just uh, I'll do a slight alteration, sir. Slight alteration. Yes. Right. I'll just chalk it. What do you think, sir? About an inch? I think so, inch yes. Inch all the yes. way up. I think that'll do it. Right. Yes. So, how long will these alterations take? Half a second, sir. There we are. Oh, yes, yes. That's much better. Much better. Oh! Tramp's trousers, sir. Tramp's trousers. Tramp's trousers. If I'm going to be a tramp, I need trousers, don't I? Of course yes. you do, sir. Yes, well, I've got the very thing over here, sir, in the What's display that? cabinet, sir. Oh, really? Are they jeans? Or... No, these were Bert's, sir. He had them for seven years and was very happy in them, sir. They're oh, lovely. Oh, oh, thank you very lovely much. Pair. Take them in for yes, the Yes, I'll try them on. Yes, shall I? Right. And while you're in there having a fit, sir, I will try and find you a nice, sensible <laughs> pair of walking shoes, sir. Hey, sir! Yes. What size do you take? Oh, a size eight and a half shoe, please. Eight and a half shoe. Well, you want two, won't you? Two eight and a half. So that's uh, two eight six and seventeen. Seventeen size. Oh, oh yes. Nice pair of seventeens there. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Lovely. Good. Uh, <clears throat> how are you doing, sir? There we are. I think that's just about it. Well, oh. What do you think, eh? Oh, sir. I'm speechless. Really? Sir. Yeah. Yo, oh, sir. I th I, that's really first class, sir. Do you know you're going to be the envy of every tramp in the country? Oh, how marvellous. <laughs> Would you like to try the shoes on, sir? The shoes? Oh, yes. Here oh, how splendid. Aren't they lovely? Yes. You, uh, just a moment, sir. Yes. Would you like the shoe horn, sir, to go with them? Well, they seem rather large. I mean, do you think I'll need a shoe horn? Oh, yes, sir. Well, these are very useful for crossing the roads with heavy traffic, sir. There you are. Oh, oh that's right, right, right. a marvellous invention. Nice, yes. I'll take the whole outfit, my good, good man. Right. That's marvellous, yes. Now, your bill. Am I? I didn't know I had to change my name to be a trap, but I suppose no, Bill no, 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 could no, no. anything else. No, I didn't mean now you are Bill, sir. I meant now you're Bill. I'll make it up. Oh, for yes, of course I see. Now, let me just check what you had. You had the hat, didn't you, sir? Yes. There's the hat, then you had the jacket. Yes. Yes, with the slight alterations, yes. sir. And, and the, the patches. Patches, 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 thank yes. you for reminding me. And the trousers. Mm -hmm. Trousers and the shoes. And the shoes. That's it, I think, oh, isn't no, it? Oh, no, and the, uh... <laughs> oh! Poor <laughs> sir, the hole. Yeah, well, that comes to, uh, 25p, sir. 25p? Yes. Tramps don't carry around that sort of money, you know. Oh. Would you, um, you settle for a cheese sandwich? Oh, yes, of course, sir. You'll need some change for that. Yes. Yeah, two pickled onions. Oh, you thank you very <laughs> much. <laughs> Pleasure to have done business with you. Good day, right. my good man. Oh, there you go, sir. Yes, bye-bye. Yes, bye-bye. <laughs> ah, what a nice man. <laughs> <laughs> Going to a concert at the Hard Rock Pool tonight. Who are you? Who's on? Cliff Pilger and Alvin Starfish. Mm. Are you going to wear anything special? Yes, if I can reach them. Reach them? Well, a pair of high heels. Here, what are they looking at? Oh, blow your bubbles at them. Go on, let's all blow bubbles. Right. 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 When I was just a little girl a couple of years ago, trouble. Yeah? I wasn't good at very much, but I knew how to blow bubbles. Yeah. I was the best bubble blower on the street. There was no one on the street I couldn't beat. One day when I was standing at the back of the school hall, I decided I would blow the biggest bubble of them all. She decided she would blow the biggest bubble of them all. And she blew. And, and she, she blew. And, and then she blew. The bubble blew. And she blew and she blew. And a great big crowd she drew. Because around and something you can see right through. There's nobody who can do a thing as great as that for you. It must, must have been the biggest bubble in the world. LC, LC, the biggest bubble blower of them all. Oh, oh. Elsie, Elsie, she blew it at the back of the hall. I concentrated very hard, that bubble, it was all blew my mind. Yeah. Stop that, you naughty girl! I didn't hear a call from behind. Yeah. The headmistress Elsie, came crumbling down the hall, scattering Elsie, the kids like snooker balls. As she stood above me, staring through the pale pink case, I got such a start, blew to heart, exploded in her face. Got such a start, blew to heart, exploded in her face. Bang! The biggest bubble blower of them all. Elsie, 
loud, see, she blew it at the back of the hall. Her cheeks were red, nose was pink, covered with bits of gum, bubble gum. Yeah. <laughs> she grabbed my ear and dragged me off, I felt really glum, double glum. Yeah. But when I came back, the kids all cheered for me, you see, they thought I'd done it all deliberately. Overnight I was a hero, but there's really nothing to it. I was only blowing bubbles, now they all want to do it. She was only blowing bubbles, now they all want to do it. Elsie, Elsie, the biggest bubble blower of them all. Elsie, Elsie, she really she blew, blew it at the back of the O. Yeah! Oh, blimey. Hmm? Here, sir. Yeah? Look what I found, sir. Buried in the sand. Oh. I think it's an old lamp. You're right, son, Major. It could do with a bit of a clean-up, though, couldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> well... The genie of the lamp. You have a wish each. Why, well, say, that's a bit of luck in this art of it. May I go first? Yes, why not, sir? Right. I, I wish that I was back in England. It is done. And you? Uh, uh, what, me, miss? Oh, uh, uh, well, to tell you the truth, miss, uh, it's a bit lonely here without Sir. I wish he was back. It is done. Oh. <laughs> You've done it again, <laughs> soft <laughs> me. <laughs> <laughs> far and wide, roving reporter of the Daily Bugle. I'm here today to cover the contest to find the party-goer of the year. The atmosphere is tense as the crowd wait expectantly for the arrival of Mr. Brian Kent, Master of Ceremonies. And here is Mr. Kent! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome to the contest to find the party-goer of the year. Now, the contestants are... Excuse me? Excuse me, are you a contestant? Uh, no, I'm here to cover the contest. Oh, I see. Would you mind... Could you possibly cover it over there in the audience? Am I in the way here? Well, only just a smidgen, you know. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's all right. Look, have a funny hat. Thank you so Go much. Go sit and enjoy yourself. I'll tell you what, you can present the prizes at the end. Right, we have so these garlands. Sorry. Thank sorry. you very much indeed. Yes, as I was saying... <laughs> yeah, as I was saying, let us welcome the contestants. First of all, representing Upper Cum Talk in Wales... How do you spell that? Uh, C W M. No Wales. Oh well, <laughs> W H A L E S. Thank you Fine. so much. Good. Fine. As I was saying, yes. Let us welcome representing Uppercum Talk in Wales, Miss Heather Williams. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Thank you very much. And uh, let us welcome then representing Ochenchuggle in Glasgow, Scotland, spelt S C O T L A N D S, Mr. Alex Norton. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> As you can hear, as you can hear, both our contestants have brought lots of supporters with them. Yes. And the supporters for Miss Williams are, of course, waving and holding daffodils. Yeah. And okay, okay, okay. The supporters, uh, the supporters with Mr. Norton are all wearing Glengarry's. Yes, let's hear it. Och and shuggle, och and shuggle. <laughs> Oh, definitely more points. Yes, they are the winners with that. I shall give ah. points. Give points for the loudest. The Welsh are leading at the moment by one point to nil as we go into the first game. First game. Which is this? The first game is nose dribbling. Nose oh, dribbling. Right. Heavy. Where are you going? To get my hanky. No, no, no. Not that sort of dribbling. No. <laughs> nose dribbling. It's like football dribbling, only you dribble these ping pong balls with your nose. With right. Yes. Yeah. I'll show you. I'll take you to the track. Right. Now, just walk this way. Walk this way. Now, the track. No, I don't mean walk backwards. I mean walk over. I'm trying to oh, tell see. people what's happening. Sorry. Here is the track yes. with various blamondas covered in gooey cream. Yes. And uh, the... Come here, please, madam. The contestants have to take from the centre here. Yes. Put their noses on the ball yes. and steer them around, trying not to get cream in their ears, up right. their nostrils, whatever else. Take your hat off, that's a good idea. Are you ready? Yes. Get steady and cheer for your teams if you see they're winning. <laughs> yes, Mr. Norton, stay in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah.
points to Wales. And now we go into a quickie. Yes. A quickie. A quickie is this. Yes. You have a piece of newspaper. Yes. Well, not newspaper, paper each. Yes. And there's a hole in the middle. Right. The idea is that you must pass the whole of your body yes. through the hole in the paper. Yes. yes. Without making a noise or without tearing it. All right? Yes. I shall be listening for noises. Those who make the most noises, of course, will lose. Are you ready? Yes. Are you ready? I must ask for silence in the audience, please, while we play this. Sorry, what was that? I said, could we have silence, please? Of course, yes. <laughs> uh, Miss Wonder, anyway. Yes, yeah, right. Right. Are we ready? Yes. Stand by. Points for Wales! <laughs> and now, the good old, the next, the next contest is this. It's the old playaway standby, which is, uh, give me a something, in this yes. case, give me a B, in which they have to mime a word or words ending with the sound B. Right, Mr. Norton, right. you will start off, please. Okay, now let's get Now, anybody, anybody who answers, if, if he's doing it and Wales answer, they get the point. Are you ready? Yes. Here we go. Okay. Ready? Let's go, Scotland. Go. I'm a B. I'm a bee. What kind of a bee am I? Rugby! Rugby for Wales! Yes! One point for Wales. Come on, the drafts! I'm a bee, I'm a bee. What kind of bee am I? Rugby! 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 What kind of cat? Tabby, 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 Tabby over there. Oh, he's got two for that. I'll have to pull one back. Six, six, one, six, two it is, but it's on to three. Yes. I'm a bee, I'm a bee. What kind of bee am I? Bobby, yes, that was a good day. Thanks. I'm a bee, I'm a bee. What kind of bee am I? I've already talked, already talked that one up. Right, what's next? I'm a bee, I'm a bee. I'm a bee. What kind of bee am I? Hello, Mum. Right, one last one from both of us. Oh, yes. yes. Right, this is from both of us. Here we go. Right. We're, we're a bee, we're, we're a bee. bee. What, what kind of bee are we? All the lights all went out. Fiji! But I was asking for G for bees, not G's, but I will give you one for that. Yeah. For getting it. So that is six, seven, five as we go into the last game. Go into the last game, which is passing the tissue. Now, passing the tissue, the contestants will join six members of their supporters and they will pass tissues from one end to the other, picking them up only with the straw, thus. And the team that passes the most will win. Are you ready? <laughs> Race, would you please bring up all the tissues? Tell me how many you have. Miss Wonderfar and everywhere. Nine. You may come and present. How many? Nine. Nine for you. Four. Four. Oh. Four. Seven. So it's a draw. Seven, seven. Seven, seven. They are. Right, give a big cheer. You've both drawn it and won it. And lost together. Well, 
Do you, might, you might like to try some of these games. Of course, you don't have to play them at home. No. You could always... <laughs> <laughs>